Hey everyone, I'm glad you joined us today. Well, we are on a little field trip. We're at the Plow and Hearth retail store. Now you might be familiar with Plow and Hearth and their online store. And you also might be familiar with them through Laura with Garden Answer. She has some Plow and Hearth products. Danielle with Northlawn Flower Farm. She also has Plow and Hearth products in her garden. But we are at the retail store today. It just so happens that I live less than an hour from the retail store and the main headquarters of Plow and Hearth. If you've just joined us today, my name is Bobby. I am a cut flower gardener and a YouTube garden content creator. We're so glad you're here. I'm going to introduce you to the social media director of Plow and Hearth. She's with us today. She's going to show us around a little bit. So I hope you really enjoy this video. Okay, so you can see that I've flipped the camera around off of myself and onto our guest for today. Could you introduce yourself? Hi everyone, my name is Michelle Barnett and I am the social media manager for Plow and Hearth and we welcome you all to our Madison Country store here in Madison, Virginia. So Michelle and I are going to take you around the store. She's going to show you some of their gardening products, some of their other products, so that you can see firsthand what they have to offer through Plow and Hearth. So let's get started. Okay, what you got for us, okay. Michelle? So one of our top sellers for gardens and everyone are our solar path lights. And I think it's fun to see these things in person because online they kind of don't really they don't really do them justice. As you can see, these are really substantial solar lights and they line your pathway and they're large and they're bright and they're really heavy, so they're high quality. They're gonna last quite a few years. I love the looks of those. Yeah, th those are definitely one of our top sellers. Okay, so we're gonna take a look at some of their bird feeders now. I know birding is a good thing for gifts around the holiday season and I actually have some of these bird feeders, these squirrel proof bird feeders and when I ordered them I was kind of amazed to see how large they were. Um, you really got to put a lot of bird seed in here but they are virtually squirrel proof. This one um, when the heavier squirrel gets on there they'll it's kind of fun to watch them spin around so it's kind of it's a bird feeder, but it's also a little bit of amusement for the yard as well, but I do, I love these. And speaking of holiday accents, this is another very popular bird house. It's um, like the Christmas cottage. I'm see the name is the Holiday Bird House, and it's very detailed. It has like the, you know, decorative ribbons and the wreaths and the garland all around. And it even has a little area in the back where you can open it up and clean it out at the end of each season. Oh, that is adorable. And it also lights up. So there's like a little battery pack in there that you can you can set it up to light up and yeah that's adorable it's very I love cute. that I do too and for any golden retrievers you have on your list we have this little small bird bath but it's very cute it's very heavy um, but it's a bird bath and some people even use it as a little bird feeder you could put some seed in there instead of water if you prefer Another popular and useful gift or tool for yourself in the garden is our garden kneeler. So you can see it kind of saves your knees. You can um, put your knees on it or you can actually adjust it and it will work as like a little stool so you can sit on it instead. And these are really sturdy. Yeah. They, you know, they hold up a lot better than yeah. some of the others on the market. Mm -hmm. I have one. They, yeah, they are very, very useful. Yes, yeah. yes, they really do save your knees. Yes. So behind you, I'm seeing all of the garden oh, yeah. clogs or garden shoes. Yeah, so we have the shoes, and then we also have the boots that come up a little bit higher. Yeah. Um, they're a great gift item, but also a gift for yourself, too. And, <laughs> yeah, and you can order these online, right? You can order everything we're looking at online? Mm -hmm. you, can, you can find everything in the store. On, well, for the most part, most things in the store you'll also find online, mm -hmm. as long as they aren't discontinued or sold out. Okay. And I know you mentioned your friends with Danielle with North Lawn Flower Farm. We did a, a little collaboration with her where she used some of these. These are our garden pathways, wooden pathways. They're really good if you're not 100% sure where you want your path or you want something that's movable. Like yeah. say you just need a little area and you're not ready to commit on like a stone pathway. These right. are good. You can move them around. You can add to them. We have the curved pieces and the straight pieces so you can um, make any type of shape pathway that yeah. you 
that you oh, like. Oh, I think our viewers will really be excited to see those because they definitely have watched Danielle mm -hmm. uh, use her several times and move them around. So to get to see them in person here at the store is really exciting. Yes, they're very nice. And over here we have um, a bunch of different hummingbird feeders and swings and accessories. But this is actually a bee house that offers a place for bees to hide or um, in, in your yard. It brings the pollinators to your garden, which obviously helps. And we have the smaller bird baths that come with a stand that you can put in your yard. And then one thing that I think is so so much fun. If you are a hummingbird lover, you can buy these so cute, these little rings. You put a little nectar. Yes, and just I've sit seen outside. Those. Yeah, yes. sit very still. I've uh -huh. never had one come to my finger before, but yeah. I guess you, you know, if you're patient enough, you right. just sit and wait for a little hummingbird to come and visit. That's super cute. Those are cute. Another popular holiday or winter item is our snowman feeder. You fill it up um, with bird seed and the birds can just get it right out of the mesh holes which are pretty big. But this is another item that I think when you see it online and you see it in person, it's definitely much larger um, than it looks online. So it holds a lot of bird seed and it really makes a good statement in the garden. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's super cute. And it also has like some solar light so um, oh. he'll light up in a couple different places. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. Very, very cute. These are some of our larger bird bass that come with an actual stand versus a hanging mechanism and they fit right on here and you can change these out per season. We have some for the springtime, some for winter, and even some for Christmas. So oh, they're very those nice. Those are so cute. I like those. And for anybody that is in the market for a stepping stone, I love these rubber stepping stones. They give you the look of a stone stepping stone, but they're, you know, they're not heavy. Yeah. You can, they're, they're heavy enough to stay in the ground. They stay put where you leave them, mm -hmm. but they won't, you know, break your back trying to carry them through the right. garden in the yard. They come in cute. like packs of, this is like three, and we have all different kinds of beehive designs, dragonfly, mm -hmm. some scroll patterns, lots of different patterns, but... They're really fun. Oh, those are super nice. Yeah, I like that idea. Mm -hmm. And then another bird bath, if you want to put it on your deck or your patio or somewhere, this is kind of like you can put it on a tabletop or the edging of a deck. It's made of metal, so it'll stand up pretty well. And then it's ridged inside to give the birds a little place to, so it's not so slippery for yeah. them. But oh, yeah, that's we have really cute. this and it also comes in a turquoise, like a light blue color. It's also mm -hmm. pretty. Um, these are like little smaller fencing. If you have some pets in your garden and you're trying to keep them out of your flower bed, mm -hmm. um, these you can just push right down in the ground, however many you need. You can make a, a little um, barrier to mm -hmm. keep your garden safe from pets. Are they metal? They're metal and mm -hmm. they're, and they're you know, they're pretty heavy. So mm -hmm. they're going to hold up for a while. Yeah. Um, but you can configure them however you need. And over here we have a ton of different gifts and tools for the gardener. This one has been a really popular item online. It is a leaf hauler. And I know a lot of you say, well, it's a tarp, but it's not. It's a tarp material in a sense. It's a lot sturdier than a tarp, but it has these edges that set up that have handles on them. Oh, so it yeah. makes them easy to rake your leaves into this leaf hauler. Yeah. They don't go out the other side and then you can just take them and pull them where they need to go with the handles. Mm -hmm. So they're a really helpful mm -hmm. item when you're trying to get up leaves. Yeah. Um, another item that's really helpful is if you do burn debris in your yard, if you have, you know, any leftover brush that you want, this is like a little incinerator. It's a smaller size burn barrel, so it's yeah. not, you know, overly large, right. but you can put your debris inside and then it has a little um, vented hood and mm -hmm. some holes on the side. It looks like it would be very safe versus an old time, you know, burning barrel. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That people tend to use that won't have a top on it. Right. And this is nice because you can, it has handles. It's not too big, so you can move it where you need it to go. Mm -hmm. And you can just use it to store things, too, if you like. Mm -hmm. Another popular um, item that we have at Plow and Hearth are our wind chimes. And they're another thing, like we have varied sizes. We have some smaller chimes and some larger chimes, but you can, you know, they all play a little bit of a different sound. Like this one is called Relax. 
This one's called Breathe. So they come in different colors with different different little sounds, but they make a really good gift. Yeah, who doesn't love wind chimes? I, I mean, so pretty. These are definitely unique. Oh yeah. And these, they're a little different. I, I'm not sure. They definitely are more visual with yeah, the mirrored. It's very sparkly. Mm -hmm. They catch the sunlight really well. If somebody well. likes glam in their garden, uh -huh. there you go. <laughs> I have one of these. It makes a different little sound with oh, the wood. Yeah. It's not yeah. the metal on metal that right. sometimes, you know. Very cute. People don't love. And these is a little four cube um, wooden garden. So you could put this in the yard, fill it with soil, and plant different types of vegetables or flowers. Oh, yes. And keeps Very it nice cute. and contained. Yes, I love that. Uh, We've had a lot of wind here recently, friends, so you can see some of the things have blown over. <laughs> uh, but Michelle's going to show us some of these benches and some of these little statues. Yeah, some we of have these all bird bats. different types of garden statues and concrete benches. Mm -hmm. I'll have to check the online availability for these because off the top of my head, I'm not sure if they right. are available online. Yeah. Um, and I know we have this is also a little three-stepped raised planter it gives oh, you a little yes. bit more garden area oh i love that yeah that's been a popular item Mhm. Mm i also love the spinners yes the spinners yes I we love have so spinners. many different types of spinners that's actually like a little smaller version spinner uh -huh. we have the larger version behind it um, we have spinners now that light up, oh, some right. that even mist water. Oh you can my. hook it up to a water hose and yeah. it'll, you know, mist some water. Yeah. Um, we have a lot of different versions of the spinners shown here without their bases, just to get an idea. All of these are available online too. Most of them. There may yeah. be some that are here that are, you know, back ordered or discontinued, right. but for the most part, um, these are available and if they're not available now we you know get some in stock again in the spring right but like yeah these it's a double so it goes you know one one way and the oh, other gosh. way so it gives you a lot of visual interest right those are super fun mm -hmm. and then you have quite a few little yeah. yard statues and right now I'm not sure if all the yard statues I'll have to google those I don't know that I've seen those online mm -hmm. Um, they're Cell probably friend, difficult. You just to have to make a trip to one of the yeah, Plow and Heart stores. One of our stores. And enjoy this in person. Mm -hmm. And another really popular item that we have are these obelisks. So we have multiple different styles and sizes, but they're really awesome. These are nice and sturdy. Mm -hmm. um, so you can grow clematis or vining plants and then you don't have to worry about right. um, them falling apart over the years they're really you know thick metal yeah they look like they're really yeah. sturdy it's really good to see those in person because i've definitely seen those online and they're um they're really they're really nice and thick and yeah. they look nice even when you don't have things on them but right. i know we have this one as a popular one and you can buy it with the flower pot also so you can layer your plantings oh what a great idea mm -hmm. you can add these on these are really nice yes that's a great idea um, I love how they've decorated the porch here too yeah, and these are one of our favorite holiday the Christmas Cardinal I know we have those and then we also have a matching a coordinating rug that has that same cardinal on it oh, I actually have that and that's one of my one of my personal favorites yeah. I love the Cardinals for Christmas and a lot of our plow customers mm. they really like the Cardinals mm. so okay. is this the that's not the trellis that Danielle has. She it? has a trellis. I don't know if hers, we have a couple different designs. And I think, I mean, it may be, I can't remember which design she chose. I think it's Hummingbird. Is it hummingbird? Yeah. So she has some of our hummingbird arches that I love. She's made like a little walkway I know mm -hmm. you've seen. And then, um, so I don't know if she got the mat. I know she has the hummingbird arch. Mm -hmm. I don't know if she got the tree of life or the hummingbird trellises that she right. used to make that um, like portable fence. Right, right. Which is a great idea. Friends, again, we're talking about North Lawn Flower Farm. Danielle at North Lawn Flower Farm. She has quite a few Plow and Hearth products. Mm -hmm. And uh, so that's who we're talking, we keep referring to in case <laughs> you're wondering. Yeah. Our friend Danielle. Yes. 
Okay. All this outdoor stuff and tons of benches. Um, you know, depending on what type of bench you prefer, we mm -hmm. have the iron benches. Mm -hmm. um, we have the the resin benches. Uh, we do have some, at, you know, a lot of Adirondack, the Pollywood right. material. Yeah. So just depending on your preference and your needs, I mm -hmm. know different weather calls for different different materials, but we have a lot of different benches. Yes, I have quite a few uh, benches from Plow and Hearth and they really hold up really well. Some of our arches. Oh, this is a geometric arch. We have that one. Oh yeah, those are uh, nice. I have I have this, so you can get you can get the arches with or without the gate. Mm -hmm. um, this one is gated, but you can buy them with or without yeah, the gate, just depending so on you. Depending on your needs. Yeah. Another I love one that. of our popular. This is a definitely larger in scale. Yes. And this has the solar light, so this actually does light up as well. Oh wow! I yeah. bet that is so pretty. Mm -hmm. It's double sided, so you actually have mm -hmm. four different four different spinners mm -hmm. at the same time. And this is these. This has been outside for a while, but this is actually also a really. This is like a gift idea for my husband. If you have a <laughs> wood burning fireplace or yeah. outdoor fireplace, these are you can stack your wood outdoors, and these are really sturdy too, yeah. so they can hold a lot of wood. And we have the covers as well to keep it dry, but. This and then the wood carts. It's also a good gift for mm -hmm. for anybody that has to lug wood around. Mm -hmm. Those are nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, these are some of our different bench designs. This is the fern garden. This is like a daisy. And that's a metal scroll design. And a lot of these benches, which is nice, we a lot of them coordinate with the arches or some of our trellises. Oh, yeah. So you can use them all. You know, oh, use great them idea if you have a theme in your garden. Mm -hmm. Yeah, great idea. This, I think, was, or something similar to this was new this year. It's another thing. Until you really see it in person, you don't appreciate the scale. Mm -hmm. But it's just like a, a, a trellis with flower pots oh, so you can yeah. plant. You know, it's some that will spill over the top and it really makes a good, it How makes a big cute. statement in the garden. And you can have some vining plants on it as well. Yeah. Which I think is nice. Super cute. So I think we got to see so much up close and personal. And Michelle did a fabulous job of taking us around, showing us some of the things that uh, Plow and Hearth has to offer. So you want to be sure you go online, check out everything they have check out their cyber deals check out their discounts sometimes they have discounts um, just check everything out online to see what you maybe you saw a product that we featured here that you just said oh wow i really want to check that out i really want to i really want to try to order one of those uh, you can definitely do that so michelle would you tell us you know where we can find you and where we can find you maybe on social media as well. Sure. So you can find all of our products online at plowandheart.com. And as Bobby said, we have some cyber deals. We also have a, a daily deal. Every day there's like a new deep, deeply discounted deal that you can check. It's always fun to see what those daily deals are. Oh, wow. You can find us on, we're on Facebook, we're on Instagram, we're actually on TikTok. That's kind of a new channel for us. Oh, exciting. Um, all under our name, Plow and Hearth. Just look for the logo and um, our content. Yeah. And it's always nice to see things online or in person that you can see, that you can shop online. That way you can right. get a little bit better idea of like right. the scale and the size of things. Yeah. But, yeah, yeah, I agree. Well, Michelle, thank you so much. It has been a pleasure to be with you today. A lot of fun getting to meet you and look around the store. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys, and please leave us a comment. Let us know if you've shopped with Plow and Hearth. Uh, we'd love to hear about your experience and what maybe you have in your garden that you've bought from Plow and Hearth. So until next time, friends, happy gardening. From Michelle and I, bye-bye.